Okay, so Starfish Girl here, back for another video, Cheese T1. Uh, the first video was a very long video and I only got two levels done. Usually you expect that further up in the set, but that's because level two was kind of a tricky dodging one. Um, that in probably a lot of other sets wouldn't necessarily be placed in level two, but this is a small set, so there's if there's a lot of tough videos you can't really uh videos tough levels you can't really put the hard ones at the very end because they're mostly hard so anyways this is level three get the chips chips there's only four chips left 250 seconds i wonder hmm okay this is interesting okay don't think i can there we go. Do that. Uh, I thought so. Now, make it go back again, I'm guessing. I don't know. Um, how? Oh, okay, so that's where the exit is. Well, that's cool. So you push the block to get to the exit when you're done. Okay. Well, I'll get that ready. Now, do I go the top or the bottom? Hopefully it doesn't matter. Okay, good. Um, uh-oh. Okay, so... Left button controls right machine. Okay, good to know. I knew that was going to happen, but... I had to just think for a second just to see what would happen. I don't know why, that was rather stupid, but. Alright, so what do I want to do first? I don't know. That one's easy. This one's harder. What? Oh. Well, that's, that's stupid. I need to do the other one first. Because it will be in the way. It will block that one from coming across. Yeah, I just realized that. Well, I kind of realized it, but it was too late. I had already done it. So. And there we go. Okay. Uh oh. I did that wrong, didn't I? Uh, shoot. Yeah, because now I can't. Shoot. Alright, let's try that again. What am I doing? <laughs> this is a really cool set so far. Okay, so how on earth am I supposed to do this? Oh, that's why there's two things. No? Then I would be trapped in there. Hmm. That was stupid. I trapped myself. Alright. This is going to take a second to think. About how I'm supposed to do this. Because I'm very confused. I know what to do. I'm just trying to figure out how to do it. That's the problem. Okay. So at first I have to do that. And then, do I go out there? No, I have to go out that one. Oh, I can come in this way. Go. Oh, okay. I know how to do it now. Yep. Duh, I go like this. I go through it again. I'm gonna go this way. There we go. Alright, that took a second to think. Wow, that was confusing. Oh, really? Oh, seriously? Okay, I was going to be really pissed if I didn't get that because I suck at that. When there's only two things with a pink ball, I always get the pink ball to the face. I was totally shocked that I got the timing right. That is one thing. It wasn't a very long level, so that's fine. 
I like that. It was short. But if there's one thing that I think a lot of other um, LPRs or like CC players would agree with, it's um, having something like that at the very end of a level. Especially if you had to do a lot of stuff in the level and then you come to the end and it's lucky timing or like really close dodging at the very end of a level that can be bad sometimes because I mean who wants to spend 20 minutes on a level only to get to the end and die and have to start all over again but being a short video and being not too too bad I mean you know it was close quarters but it wasn't horrible dodging it was just a ping ball and it wasn't a very long level so I think that was fun it was cool it was a different concept than I've ever seen before and so let's go to the next level uh, bouncing blocks. Oh, this was. I know how to play this. Now look, the question is, will I play it correctly? Let's see. This was in CCLP3. Huh. This is a cool level. Okay, I have to remember to. <laughs> I have pushed the block before without doing the green key and then I had to push it all the way back. Uh, doing the green key, unlocking the green key. Okay, crap. Now... I think I'm doing... There we go. I want to make sure I don't do that wrong. Okay. So now... Crap, how do I do this? I have to unlock that. Okay, so I'm going to push it there and then go up myself. There we go. Okay. So. Okay, now. There we go. There we go. Oh, yeah, no, no more. I was going to say, I could have just left it there and then done that and come back, but need the blue key underneath the block first. Duh. Alright, there we go. <laughs> now I actually have pushed the block straight down and gone straight with the ice skates to avoid the block and gotten the block in my face, which was rather st stupid. <laughs> Pretty funny, but <laughs> I actually did that. <laughs> and that's a cool level. That was in CCLP3. Wait, CCLP3? It's gotta be CCLP3, right? Or am I mixing it up with CCLP2? I don't know. Anyway, all of my CCs are getting... CCLP3 I'm still trying to finish, and it's a very long one, and so I'm getting really mumble-jumbled about things that are in... Ooh. This looks tricky. I'm guessing you... Whoa, what the heck? Okay. This looks very interesting. Clearly, I have to stop the tank somehow. That's not there. So I have to go in here. Okay, so this is safe. Okay. There. What's safe on top is not safe on the bottom. Like that, see? You have to go it's safe here, but below me it's not safe, so. There we go. What? What the heck? Okay, I'm, I don't want to go back through that, so I'm just going to die. There's two red keys. What the heck? Do I really have to? No. Wow, do I really have to dodge all of this? Because if I do, this is going to be a pain. Okay, well, it's not as bad as I thought. Okay, except I want to do that last. It's good, this part is the part that's the... Okay, so not as bad as I thought. It just looks really bad at first. Okay. Uh, yeah, not 
let's not do that. Okay, there, there. There, there. Okay. Well, if I can just do it correctly on the bottom, I'll be all set. Okay, there, there. There we go. No, what the? I'm going to do the bottom first. No, what the? Ugh. Sometimes I hate tile world. Okay, go, go. There we go. No. See, what happened the first time when I died was I went up and I went for the tank on the top and then the bottom. When I should have gone on the bottom and then the top. But this time, I'm doing it the right way, and it's still not cooperating. There we go. Sometimes, I don't know, the controls are sticking. That was another problem in the last level of this set that I faced. Was, oops. There was a couple of times where I stopped moving. I was, like, I stopped pushing the button. I was not moving. And yet, I moved anyways and was killed. You know, the stupid tile world controls when you stop pushing the button but it makes you move in that direction anyways yeah and glider dodging you know you kind of get a glider to the face oops I paused for a second there all right stop talking about the last level and concentrate okay this is actually really cool despite my numerous deaths here I'm not, I'm failing to do it quick enough. Oops. I'm like a second off and it's killing me. There we go. Could have to do with the step two though. I, although I don't know how the step works in Tell World. Like it does in CC. Uh, CC. MS. Whatever. MSCC. Whatever it's called. You know how the the timing where like you're off a half a step or something? I don't know how that works in Tower World. Okay. Now I've been doing the bottom, I'm blinking on the top. There we go. I had to think for a second. Oh, okay, this part's gonna be hard. I was so worried about dodging <laughs> And tank on top that I went too far down and I like ah panicked. <laughs> okay, that's easy enough. Watch you go through all of that and then die on the other section. There we go. Okay, now let's not panic here. Okay, I'm safe here. No, what the heck? This is cool because it's not like so, like, they're not crisscrossing each other, but you have like one instant to get it right. I mean, well, you kind of have to get it right, boom, or you get killed, but they don't overlap and make it new, like, really, really hard. So it's just the right amount of distance for dodging which makes it a challenge but yet not so hard at the same time no come on I almost went straight into that tank too just now when I was coming down I good thing tile world controls didn't make me keep going because if there were ever there was a time for tile world controls to glitch it would have been then I seriously thought I was going straight into the tank okay there we go. Ooh. That's gonna be hard unless the tanks get stopped. Well, I don't know. What the heck? Ugh. Hate it when the timing is screwed. Whoops. Okay. So now. Okay. I don't remember that I am. There we go. I think what happened was I went too early. Yeah. Oops. Oh, wow. Now that was a stupid death. I was anticipating the move down and swiftly going up. <laughs> I was 
somehow I just swiftly went up without moving down first. <laughs> I was so concerned about missing the tank on the bottom that I didn't even get the chip. <laughs> ah! Wrong time. There we go. No! Yes. Okay. This is pretty, I mean, I don't know, it's dodging, but it's not horrible dodging, it's a small level size, so I can take it. There we go. For some reason, those, those two are going around in a circle, yet these are flipping. I don't know what the difference is. I don't know why. Oh yeah, see, that's, that's the problem I'm having with this. How do I, why are those flipping and those spinning in circles? That doesn't make sense to me. They're all exactly the same, so why should those spin in a circle and not let the other ones just flip up and down? Doesn't make sense, and I'm not seeing how I can easily get past that. Ah, come on. Come on. The psychology of tanks. <laughs> no, there's not really any psychology to tanks. Just a blue button makes them go. Wonder what's controlling them though. It must be a pink ball, usually that's what it is. Ooh, I almost snagged the chip again and killed myself. Okay, what do I want to do here? Yeah, I want to do that one first because then this one's easier. Just go like that. And then go like that. So here I want to grab... There we go. Okay, that spot is safe again. I forgot. I forget that's safe. No! Why did I do that? Ah, I... Ugh, oh my gosh. I intended to go and then just go. I was going to wait a second before I went, but then I went. And it was too late to move because I had already gone and I froze. If there's anything worse than stupid control glitches, it's hand glitches. It's when your fingers don't cooperate. Yeah, that is still really bizarre. I mean, look. These two tanks are spinning around in circles, but these two, the six tanks here, don't. For some reason, they flip up down. I mean, they do not flip in a circle like those, and I don't understand that. I just want to see something. No? They both start in the same direction as all the other tanks. I thought maybe they started side. No, if they started sideways, they wouldn't go anywhere. Never mind. I don't know. I don't know what I was thinking. That's just weird. I don't know why they're doing that. Some sort of a glitch in the creation or something. And that's just weird. They spin in a circle instead of flip up and down. Or not up and down, but you know how the tanks go forward and then they reverse themselves. All the other tanks just flip forward and reverse. That time I was not in sync with the... I was too far away from the... Tank. There was a space between me and the tank. Okay, come on now. We need to get this. Okay. There we go. Okay, so now. No, what the? Mm. I hate it when you're a second off. So then the tank's already coming when you're trying to do it when the tank is going away, but it's coming to you when you... Da! Ah, hate that. Alright, come on. Come on! Dodging. Wow, 22 minutes into this video and it's all dodging. Okay, two, two levels per video is... This is gonna take a while. I mean, it's only a 63 level set, but two levels per video is not very good progress. Oh, I thought I was too late that time, but I just made it. <laughs> there as well. 
Okay. No, I was late that time. Come on. Okay. Um. Oh, come on. So do the keys not matter? Because I don't see a green button anywhere. I think I'm just supposed to let the tank go through the teleport and go out the exit. Oh, that's the, you can't, that's not the right exit or something. That's just weird. Oops. <laughs> so... So now, no, I do not understand this at all. Maybe after a while the green thingy is unlocked or something, I don't know. I mean the toggle doors, I'm not sure. I'm not understanding how that works. How am I supposed to get this? Is this level like busted or something? I am not understanding. I need the red key to finish the level, but I can't get it because it's hiding behind a green toggle. I am. This is 31 minutes into the video and I am not understanding this. Okay. I hate to do this. I am going to have to resort to looking in the editor because I don't usually do this, but I am very confused. And I'm not seeing this as being solvable for some reason. And whoops, <laughs> seeing a piece of one of my levels in development. Well, I finished developing it, but <laughs> I think I just finished playtesting it to make sure it's doable. Uh, okay, level one. Next. Two. Okay. Timing. Oh, there's... What? There's supposed to be a green button there. Is there a toggle button there? And I just didn't see it. Okay, I don't think you can see what I am looking at right now. So let me... Bring it into view. Okay. Am I that dumb that there is a green button right there and I did not see it? Wow. I would laugh my head off if that was the case. There has to be. But for some reason I just never noticed it. Oh, because when you come out of the teleport you're on top of it. That's why. I never noticed that. Wow. Now that's a dumb mistake. <laughs> I thought maybe, you know, there was a bug or something going around the edge of the level and it would eventually push the button once it got all the chips or something or like a um, teeth or something when I reached over there or something. Wow. Seriously? The green button was right there. I was on top of it. Wow. I'm stupid. Huh. One of those dumb moments. Huh. Well, that's a totally understandable one because how are you going to know you're on top of the green button? You can't see it because there's no other space beyond the teleport to notice that you're standing on it. So, that's not really stupid, but <laughs> not as stupid as. I don't even I'm trying to remember what the. It was like a dumb moment. Oops. <laughs> I totally wasn't paying attention there when I grabbed that chip, but I got lucky. Oops. Okay, for a split second, I kind of saw the green button there. No, I knew as soon as I did that that I was going to die, and I did. Yeah, you can see the green button. If you're looking for it, if it goes slowly enough, 
Clean the screen. Oh, come on. Yes. Okay, now the tricky part is do not screw here. Yes. Delay! No! No! I hate delay. I just knew that was gonna happen. It has to happen. It's a small level. I have 40 minutes of footage now almost. And no progress. <laughs> In a small set I'll take it though because these are really good levels for the most part. So... I mean, I cannot complain there, but if there's anything that irks me more, it's when you get killed right after a whole bunch of progress near the end, and that was a stupid death. That was my fault. Now I gotta watch out for that. You tank. Okay, finally. Oh, I see why. Okay, that pink ball wasn't doing anything. Did I just kill myself? You're supposed to push that over here so that the pink ball does the blue tank in a long stride so that he comes down here. Wow. I don't think I can... No. Nope. Fudge. Wow, I can't believe I did that. I was just like pushing it like, wait a minute, it's not doing anything. But by the time I realized it, it was too late because... I had no way of retrieving the block because I wasn't all the way against the pink ball. I was a space off, but oh, all over again. I am almost on 50 minutes of footage and this is one level. Well, I did one before this. This is level four, right? No, level five. Okay, so did I do two levels before this? I guess so. I did that wrong. Oops. Okay. So you block this one up. And then you go like that. Finally, ha, huh. 48 minutes, well, about 10 seconds, it'll be 49 minutes of footage, and I'm only on level 5, and wow, so almost like 50 minutes, plus, I don't know how long I spent on the first two levels, so, you have some really difficult, like, small, but difficult, and simple, but difficult levels, and that's kind of nice sometimes. I mean, you think, oh, puny level is going to be easy, but sometimes they're the trickiest. <laughs> I mean, bigger levels are maybe uh, are just more time-consuming. These are just, well, yeah, they're time-consuming, but it's just harder dodging. Whatever. I'm going to stop the video there for now and see you in the next video. Sorry for the <laughs> crappy commentary. Um, It's late. And... I'm probably going to bed in a minute, um, <laughs> so Starfish Girl signing out.